it's tough. It's tough to listen to your daughter coughing all night long. Didn't get no sleep. It's very serious and it started to take its toll. Watching their daughter Lauren live with cystic fibrosis has been heartbreaking for Paul and Ruth Riley. CF patients struggle to breathe because the genetic disorder causes the body to create thick mucus in the lungs. <laughs> Wearing a shaker vest to dislodge the mucus was a regular part of Lauren's life. Coughing. I, I've coughed my entire life, you know. Lauren was not diagnosed until age 18, but her parents feared something was wrong even before, as the young woman dealt with sinus infections, pneumonia, and was in the hospital multiple times. And then there was the time Lauren passed out during a seventh grade track meet because she could not breathe. And then she just hit the ground. She couldn't breathe. Cystic fibrosis is a life-threatening disease. Lauren, now 25, has volunteered to be part of local research. Just because that's how we figure out if things work or not. The Marilla family is now thrilled to hear that the FDA approved a new breakthrough treatment called Trikafta, a therapy that could help decrease mucus production in 90% of CF patients. I just want this to work for everyone. It is estimated Trikafta will cost over $300,000 for a year's therapy. But families like the Rileys hope insurance companies will realize the new drug is still cheaper than paying for multiple hospital visits. And for this family, the new therapy offers hope for their daughter's future. We have very high hopes, very high hopes. And just a reminder that now through the end of October, all local quick fill gas stations will be selling these pumpkins. And the money raised will help the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation fund further research. In Buffalo, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.